you doing? Guys, it was like our radio lead off with the camp, yes. Well, John, you must be uh, absolutely gutted by that, but proud at the same time. I'm just very proud of the efforts, yeah. No, obviously, when it goes down to penalties, it's a, it's a bit of a lottery. Uh, but very, very proud of um, the squad of players that we used tonight and, and also very proud of the supporters. You know, they were awesome tonight and uh, it's great to see um, a full house at the, at the uh, Ewood Park. You couldn't have asked for any more, could you? No, since we've come in, I, have, you know, I couldn't ask for any more effort and desire and togetherness for the five games now that we've had. Um, you know, the, um, you can see that everyone's really... Um, fighting and looking after each other and you can see the, the style of play is improving you know, game by game but also that level of commitment to keep the ball out of the net is obviously um, there for everyone to see as well so it's, it's going to take time, you know, we haven't had much time on the training field but what we have in short periods of we've been able to do some coaching as you, know, you can see the lads are really taking the messages on board. There were some heroic moments back there defensively weren't there? There was, yeah, from the whole group, you know, from the, the, the subs that came on, the, the goalkeeper, the defenders, the attackers, you know, to keep, to keep the goals out of the, goal, uh, out of the goal, you need to be a, a collective, it's not any individual and, um, you know, it's something that we've been working on very hard since we've come in um, to, to, to limit chances to the opposition, to limit the goals and, um, you know, I think, I think you can see that everyone's trying the hardest uh, not to concede. How pleased were you with the number of chances that you had and created and, and got on target against the Premier League side? Yeah, as I say, we're making small steps forward. You know, we're playing against the top Premier League team, top players, and um, you know, I was really pleased with the game plan on how we wanted to set up. You could see that we could we could hurt them in certain areas, and um, you know, on another day we could have had a couple more goals. Does this give you all the confidence you need and your players as well to to think that there is only a four point gap between yourselves and the bottom three, but? With performances like that, John, you're not going to be there very long, are you? We'll have to wait and see. You know, it's work in progress. You know, the championship is relentless. We've been here five games. We've had six, ga six games in 18 days. So the commitment that the, 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 the lads have showed me that you know, they're a good, young, hungry group with some good experience and we've just got to keep working hard. We take each game as it comes. And, um, you know, I'm not looking at the league table at the moment. I just worry about the next game. And the next game is uh, Swansea, which is going to be a really difficult game, but we'll be prepared for and ready. Sam Gallagher picked up an injury tonight. He was a bit tight, but you know I, I don't think it's anything to worry about. Did anybody else pick any issues up? No, or nothing. Tactical substitutions? Played? Absolutely. Again, that's our sixth day, game in 18 days, so we have to use the squad. If we're going to be successful with anything we do uh, this season, it's about the squad of players. you know. And uh, I think the squad was used very well tonight. And... Um, uh, you know, everyone played a massive part in, in the, the, the very, very good performance. John, we've spoke so much since you've come in about, you know, qualities in terms of defensive work, work rate, but quality on the ball tonight, some really, really good spells. Yeah, there was, you know, and I think there was some good spells on, on Saturday. Uh, there was some good spells against Cardiff as well. Uh, today, you know, it all came together and, um, you know, we played some really good stuff. Um, against a really difficult opposition, but you know it, it'd be nice if we were a little bit more clinical, of course. But um, you know, again, I couldn't fault the efforts of the group. I was very proud of, of everyone out there today. Does that feel like a bit of a blueprint going forward for Blackburn like Rovers and, and what you would like the group to look like as, as they progress? Yeah, absolutely. Of course it would, but you know it's going to take a lot of hard work. You know we need time on the training field, um, but you could see with the games that we're playing. Um, the, the group are, are gelling to what we want and how we want them to play. But again, you know, it's it's just small steps. You know, it, we're playing against a good team, great atmosphere tonight. Uh, the fans played a massive part in that as well. I was very proud of the effort of uh, of them, and um, it really helped us uh, perform. And the spirit to come from behind as well after you made yourself an even younger team on the pitch. But the, the spirit with ten minutes left to, to produce that equaliser in that moment. Yeah, it's important that we show that never die attitude. You know, it's something that I'll I, I want to bring into the squad of players. Um, you know, that's the second time this season now we've come from behind at home. Um, so again, you know, it's just making small steps. You know, small steps, and this group are taking everything that we want on board. And I was very very proud of everyone involved today. You've spoken about the need to use the squad as well. The, the subs made a big impact as well. Dylan and, and Yasin in particular, and, and 
it shows that you've got players on the bench you can use and you'll have to use, obviously. Of course we will, yeah. We're going to have to use the whole squad. I said from the day I came in that it's about the squad. It's not about any individual player. There's going to be suspensions. There's going to be injuries, you know, and everyone has to feel part of this family. And um, it is a family that we're growing. And, uh, you know, I want as much positivity around the place as we can have because that's the only way we're going to move forward. And, um, you know, the fans tonight were outstanding. Yeah, he took a knock on his ankle on Saturday, um, which was, um, you know, full credit to him. He got through 60 minutes on on quite a, a bad knock, so we rested him, and we'll have a look at him uh, hopefully for the weekend. Is there a chance for the weekend? I hope so. Yeah, sure. Cheers, John. Thank you. Thank you. Any more guys? Happy. Okay, perfect. Thank you. Cheers. Thank you. Cheers.